All right, guys, so if your iPad completely died like this one and you plug it in, so I'm just gonna plug it in right now. How do you know if it's charging? Well, there should be something popping up like this. So you see that? That means it's charging. If you don't see this, then it's not. Then it's supposed to just turn on, by the way. But if I take this off, I'm gonna see this as well. So let's see if I take it off. All right, it tells you to charge it up. So again, I'm just gonna plug it in. Uh, this is the second time I'm plugging it in. So at this point, I'm gonna see this. So it was completely dead. Since I plugged it in for like a second, it does charge the battery enough for it to power on. And there we go. So right now, battery wise, it's around 1%. So let me just turn that on again. 1%. So as long as you have 1% of your battery, it should technically turn on. And when it was completely dead, of course, we saw the other little logo thing with the battery. But if your iPad is really not charging and you're not seeing this anywhere, that little, so if you're not seeing this, that it's charging, then there is a problem. So you guys could have a problem with the cable that you're using. So maybe try another one. Uh, hopefully it's not the port. That would be the last thing that I would look at, your actual port for your iPad. Hopefully that's not the case. Also take a look at where you're charging it from. So here's the brick that I'm using. This is by Apple. Okay, I'm not using a third party one. So this, this other one would be a third party one. This is no good, but I'm not saying that not all third party ones are good. I mean, there's some good ones out there, but I always use the Apple ones just safer for your electronics. And if you're not using this, then make sure and try it out with the computer. So make sure it's USB-C and then just go on. Again, it does depend which iPad you guys have. Maybe it's not a USB-C port that you guys need. And then maybe if you guys are plugging in your cable here directly to one of these things, maybe that's the problem. This doesn't provide enough power or it's just not working. Anyways, just try a few things, see what works, what doesn't, and then you will know what the issue is. Now, the very last thing that you guys should look at is your actual port. Maybe it's damaged. Hopefully that's not the case. And if you did get this wet at any point in time, don't charge it right away. Leave it. But anyways, as far as this video goes, we're all done. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.